Blood vessels form extensive networks that supply our organs with nutrients and oxygens and thereby keep our bodies healthy. Blood vessel dysfunction is, contributes to many diseases like diabetes where impaired blood vessel function can lead to severe complications such as kidney failure, blindness or amputations. We know that in diabetic patients the high blood sugar damages the blood vasculature but currently we don't understand how this works in detail and how we can prevent this. Mainly because we have been lacking a good model system to study this process in the lab. Now for the first time we managed to grow human blood vessels from stem cells in the lab. We call those lab-made vessels vascular organoids. Like the blood vessels of our body, vascular organoids are formed by endothelial cells that lie in the inner coat of our blood vessels and parasites, the cells that wrap around them. They also form a lumen for blood transport and make a basement membrane. The basement membrane is an important coat around our blood vessels that gives them physical support. What is so exciting about our work is that we managed for the first time to grow real blood vessels from human stem cells that we can now use to study vascular diseases in the lab directly on human tissue. To mimic now the situation of a diabetic patient, we added a lot of sugar to our vascular organoids. What we could observe under the microscope is what usually happens in diabetic patients. The basement membrane around these blood vessels became massively enlarged and therefore impairs the diffusion of oxygen and nutrients to the organs. We also observed that blood vessels became dysfunctional and eventually died off. Now our vascular organoid system allows for novel drug testing even in high throughput. And excitingly we could identify one novel compound that could prevent all the signs of diabetes mediated blood vessel changes. Uh, <clears throat> so blood vessels play roles in basically every disease from, <clears throat> from cancer, so they support uh, how tumor cells grow, uh, to Alzheimer's disease, to diabetes. Uh, so blood vessels are really fundamental to life and, and of course are fundamental to disease. And it has not been possible to properly study human blood vessels in disease. And uh, Rainer Wimmer really developed the technology for, to, for the first time, develop perfectly human blood vessels. Uh, and this really allows us now to study the diseases of, of these blood vessels. And it's a total game changer because um, all of a sudden we can actually use human blood vessels uh, and use the potential of this technology to figure out disease and probably also figure out possible new medicines to treat such diseases. <clears throat>